Hey, it's Screw the System Joe and I'm back with another new video. This time I want to talk to you about life goals because I had a revelation earlier this year when I was setting my New Year's resolutions. I look back through my diaries at my previous entries and could see that I usually set about 10 goals each year. Now these would range from getting a certain amount of hypnotherapy clients each month to earning a certain amount of money each month to more recently achieving a certain amount of book sales. Now I was shocked to find that out of these 10 goals I was probably only achieving about two or three of them. This was very disappointing and I wanted to know why. And after much consideration I came to the conclusion that it wasn't because the goals I was setting were impossible, it was because I was setting too many of them. And now that's why I've made this video, because I've got a very important question for you. What's your Mount Everest? So when I say what's your Mount Everest, what I mean is what's the one major goal this year you want to achieve above all others? Because I'm convinced after my experience that we only have enough energy with everything else we got going on to focus on one major goal at a time. So whether it's weight loss, starting a new business or finding love, the energy it takes to achieve that is all consuming. I mean, think about it. While we're working towards our goal, we've still got to pay the bills, maintain our friendships, and deal with any major or minor emergency that comes along. So that's why I'm suggesting to you it's a far better strategy to just focus on one goal and cut out all the rest. Having said that though, by achieving that one goal, you're going to experience a load of kickbacks. Let's use weight loss as an example. Let's say you wanted to lose 30 pounds in the next year. Now having achieved that goal, not only would you get healthier and fitter, but your confidence would improve and who knows, your love life may benefit as well. So what I'm saying to you is it's far better to, achieve, to focus on one goal and achieve it than to focus on many and achieve none. So in summary, here's what I want you to do. Take your one major goal for this year and focus all your energy on achieving it. And remember, it's not called Mount Everest for no reason. At times while you're trying to achieve your goal, it may feel like a complete uphill struggle. But if you keep it clearly in mind and stick to it, then you will be successful. So now that I've told you about the Mount Everest concept, it's only fair that I share mine with you. Now my Mount Everest for this year is to work on average for 2 hours 45 minutes daily on my Screw the System project. Now this might mean blogging, making these videos, going on social media and doing talks occasionally as well. Now that's on top of all the tennis coaching and hypnotherapy and trying to have a life outside of it as well. Now I came to the figure of 2 hours 45 minutes because it's in line with the 10,000 hour rule which states that it takes 10 years or 10,000 hours of work in a particular field to become an expert. Now 2 hours 45 minutes is what it breaks down to on a daily basis. And you can see in my diary here that I tick off every day when I complete that amount of work. I'm actually 6 days behind at the moment so I need to do some catching up. It's also interesting to note that expert blogger John Morrow on his blog states that you need to do 20 hours of work a week for three to four years to become a successful blogger. So with all these things in mind, that's how I came up with my two hours, 45 minutes figure each day. And now that I've shared my Mount Everest with you, I want to know what yours is. Yours is. So please tell me in the comments section below and good luck in achieving it. And remember, keep climbing. 